Hey, what up guys, it's Brandon here, and welcome, well, this is like just a simple video, kind of, um, on a game that I've recently, that I did a playthrough on back in October, um, which is Sonic Adventure DX. Well, I finished it in October, but I began it like a year ago, so yeah. Um, hang on, I gotta fix my controller real quick. There we go, fixed it a little bit. But yeah, so I decided just to do this for the 25th, the 25th anniversary of Sonic. I'm actually going to move on down a little bit. But yeah, I decided just to do this at, for the 25th anniversary of Sonic, because that's today is the 25th anniversary. Um, June 23rd, 1991, when Sonic the Hedgehog was first released. So that's why I'm doing gameplay on, well not a gameplay, but I mean it's just it's just another add-on video for my for my um playthrough. This was the file, yeah. This was the file I did a playthrough on. So um yeah. So I'm gonna go and choose Sonic. And yeah, because I recent because last the last video I did for the playthrough was um the. Yeah, I was doing the final boss, and I finished the game. And if you, if any of you, any of you have been subscribed for me for um, long enough, you probably already know my playthrough. But if, if none of you do, if any of you have been subscribed like later than that, um, the yeah the the playlist of my of this playthrough will be in the description if you want to check it out. So, anyways, I'm gonna show you the Chell Garden. Because that's what this video is going to be about. I'm going to show you the Chow Garden for this entire video. I didn't even check it yet. So. Or maybe I did. Look at all the. Wait. Oh. Oh. That, that, that is. Okay. So, whatever file you choose for, for this game, it'll, be, it'll just be the same Chow data. All right, then I'll just, I guess I'll just show you the chows then. So, here's Buddy. He's very happy. And, I don't know. I just call him Buddy. Um, what's his name? Eddie. I don't know why I called him Eddie. I just come up with these random names, that's all. But, um, here we got Shiny, because he looks shiny and green. So, yeah. Got him. Next we have Speedy. Um, I don't know why I call him Speedy. Probably because he's blue like Sonic. <laughs> oh yeah, that's already buddy. Oh, we got two more Chow over here. Are you Randy? Yes, you are Randy. Just another random name. I think he's Goldie. Yeah, cause he and this Chow is always tired. Every time I always see this chow, he's always tired. I call him Goldie because he's a gold chow. Pretty nice. But, um... I, by the way, I love this music a lot. I'll save you. Ah. I also like the area as well. But yeah, it's really nice here. You can go in the water and everything. You can get over here. Even the child could get over here too. I could bring bring some over here, or one of them. I'll choose you, shiny. All right. I just put him in here, and he's fine. Cause he won't he won't have to like look at his face is like in the water, like he's just sit. Wow. He's not even drowning or anything. Don't okay. If you if you go in that water, he's gonna drown. Yep. So. That's why we take him out. Come on, Eddie. Don't go in there. I, I, that's why I took you out for a reason. But yeah. I'm going to show you the Chow Transporter. That you basically need the Game Boy Advance for. So you can drop off, which, unable to select. Please bring a Chow. Oh, you're supposed to bring a Chow. Yeah. So you can, like, name a Chow... If you if you use the goodbye, you, that means you get rid of your chow and you will never see it again. So if you want to get rid of your chow, go ahead and do that. But 
I'm keeping all my chow. So yeah, that's basically the chow transporter. I'm going to show you the black market. So the black market. Well, it's basically a market where you buy items. You can buy various items with your rings. What can I do for you? I'm buy items. So you can buy chow eggs, uh, fruit. I can buy anything because I have over... Actually, no I can't because I, I don't have enough to get these. A cardboard box, flower pot, pan, stump, wool, beanie. Oh yeah, I know those. But yeah, so... Um, that's basically what you can do there. I'm not really buying anything, so... Um... Chow race, we'll go back to that later. I want to show you the other Chow Gardens, though. Um, let's go here first. So that Chow Garden was the Station Square version. I'm going to show you the Mystic... K Mystic... What is it? Mystic Ruins, yeah. <laughs> I was about to say Mystic K from Sonic the Hedgehog 2. But no. Oh, you're on top of this giant rock, bro? Hey, buddy. Oh, your name's James. Just a random name for that Chow. There's probably only these two chow. I got Mike. Mike and James. They're just both the same thing. I think he, he just... Mike just frowns and I believe James is smiling. Yeah. James smiles. Mike frowns. Those are probably the only chow in this area. So we have... There's nothing that much here to show. We got a beautiful waterfall. Oh yeah, if you go through there, that just leads to the Mystic Ruin stage. The area. Alright, now let's go to the egg carrier. So yeah. The egg carrier, the egg carrier stage, this is what it looks like right here. Look, look what I call this chow right here. Tupac, the rapper. The rapper from the 90s. <laughs> I just wanted to call him that. So. Not being racist or anything because it's a black chow. But we got Brian here. Random chow name. And what is this chow? He has bunny ears. Drake? <laughs> oh, yeah. I remember calling him Drake. I don't even know why. <clears throat> well, I'll show you this. Look at this. I always like to go up here and just jump all the way down. Like this. I always like to do that. Whoa. Alright. I'm gonna try again. Oh crap. Wow. Uh, alright. Wait. Oh, we got a green chow here. Gary. Wow. I forgot about that chow. Oh, that's Tupac again. Is it? Yeah. Whoa. Alright. This music is just so catchy as well. Oh wait, I forgot to show you about feeding the chow. So these come from the trees, you have to go and you get you can feed them. Feed the chow if I can find a chow. Oh Drake wants wants some food. And it raises their stamina when they eat it. He has no stamina. Wow. Alright then. See his stamina is going up right over there. It shows his stamina is going up. Which is pretty neat. So now, I think I can now show you. I'm gonna show you the chow race now, so we can just go back over here to Station Square, to the Station Square version of the Chow Garden, and we can go to the Chow race. And here's the Chow race. I also like this song. Which, this song is from Sonic Adventure 2. The Chow Race entrance thing. Alright, which one is my best? Well, he only has that stamina, so I'm just going to go with... Let's see. Drake, because he has running. And we'll see what... Um, let's see here. Pearl Course. And now, here's how the race is supposed to be. 
you got like eight different chow. You press the A button to make the chow go faster by like making this noise. And you know what's weird about this game is that when you're control you're like controlling your own chow, right? But from time from now to then, it'll switch it'll switch you to another chow that you have to make that other yeah look. So you have to make this chow go faster as well. So you're basically trying to you're basically trying to lose anyway. See that? It, it switches to other chows. So in, in Sonic Adventure 2, you can only control your own chow. But I but in this game, you, you can control any other chow. So you can basically try to make yourself lose. Wait, I got last. My chow got last. Well, I got I think I got six. Yeah. Well, that was good though. See what see what I mean about that? That's what I meant about the how you like control other chow. Like I don't I don't know why the game like made you do that. So good thing they fixed that problem when it came to Sonic Adventure 2. So yeah. Well, basically, I have nothing else to show. So I'm probably gonna feed this chow, and then I might. Just close this off, so let's let's go feed some chow. You can also pet them as well. Press the Y button to pet, or press the X button to pick up. You can even use other characters too, I think. Yeah, let, let me do that. Whoa, okay. So you could just go back and... Yeah, I believe so. So yeah, you can use Sonic, um, you can also use Tails, I believe. You, I think you can use different other characters. So. Select your character. I'll show you Tails. And yeah. Just gotta wait for the screen to load and stuff. Now we can go in here and go to the Chow Garden with Tails. So you don't have to just use Sonic, you can use other characters. You can use Tails, Knuckles, Amy, Big, and Gamma. But yeah. Sip, you can be here with Tails, you can fly and everything. Look at that. I just saw the Chow with the question marks. They're like, who, who the heck is that? Usually we see Sonic here, but I guess Tails is here now. Or what is this fox doing in, at our Chow Garden? Yeah. Wow. Or I could go to... Yeah, we could... I guess we could go over here. And we could see if we could fly over there. Look at that. I think you could fly... Wait, no, you, actually, you can't go off the boundary. You can't, like, do that. I'm pretty sure... You can actually probably do that in, like, the original Mystic Ruin, so... Yeah. I think you could just exit, anyway. Oh. Does it, does it actually just send you back to Station Square? Or, I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Okay. If it actually sent me back to Station Square, I'd be like, "What's the point? If you're gonna, if you're gonna like quit, if you're gonna like quit back to Station Square, you're gonna like." Okay, let's go. I don't know. But now I'm gonna show you Knuckles. Knuckles at um the Chow Garden. Just gotta wait. I just thought this was a perfect. Also, I thought this was just like a perfect video. Well, well, not a perfect video, but I, I thought it was like a good video to do for the 25th anniversary of Sonic. Because I, because ever since I completed the, I finished the playthrough of Sonic Adventure DX, I've been always thinking of, I should have, I should have done the Chow Garden video. But now I'm doing it. Eight months later. Oh, my controller stopped. Oh, that's evil. Oh, I hear animals. Alright, crap, my controller stopped. That's dumb. 
hate that. When I'm recording, it has to stop. It's still not even working. Okay, there we go. Uh, I guess that's okay. Nope, it stopped again. Ugh. I hate this controller. It's a controller input in my GameCube. That's the problem. Ugh. God dang it. I'm... Okay, this is annoying. Ugh. See, now, this is stupid. Alright, you know what? I guess... Ugh. I have to, like, push my finger on the controller. On the thing, the controller that's inside the GameCube. I'm about to break the console itself. If it keeps doing that full crap. Okay, now I'm getting really frustrated. Holy crap. Select your character. There we go, finally. Jeez, the controller sucks. Well, well, not my controller. I got this. I got this controller in like October. Yeah, for my birthday. Shortly after, right after I finished this playthrough. So, but it's the controller input. And back, back in the day. Well, not, not back in the day. I mean, like, since before like 2014. Oh wait, I'm not going over there. Before 2014 and like. Ever since I found out about the freaking controller input thing, I just always I've always played GameCube games on my Wii. And when 2014 came, when my my disc reader actually broke, so I have to go back to go back to this. Go use it. I mean, I like using the GameCube though. It's it's pretty old. I mean, it's it's the classic way you could play to play this game anyway, or other GameCube games. So. I mean, but I still gotta deal with the controller, the sucky controller input. Well, wow, Amy, Amy like glides a little bit like that. Like, when you're like jumping high, she just glides. She can even use a hammer. Oh my god. Imagine Amy just whacking a child with. Oh my god. Should I do it? Wake up! Oh wait, hang on. Sorry, I have to do this though, but, uh. Wake up! Oh! Oh my god, did you see that? I am so sorry. Is he upset? Yeah, I think he is upset a little bit. It's okay. He's still sleepy, look at this. You see this right now? He is sleepy. Got them sleepy eyes. If you could tell, like, what on the top of the child's head has that squiggly symbol, that means it's sleepy. If that's a question mark, that means it doesn't know what what the heck is going. What? He, this child's coloring. Whoa! Nice job. Look at that. He made a picture on the ground of a child. You are definitely gonna be an artist someday. Wow. You seeing this right now? Wow. <laughs> All right then. Well, what else am I going to do? Well, I don't know, I'm just going to... Whoops. <laughs> I pressed the start button instead. Alright then. So now we could... I'm, well, I'm not... Actually, I'm not going to use big. I'm going to use gamma. Gamma, I like gammas. Gamma could even go to... So... Yeah. You can actually use Gamma in the Chow Garden as well. I don't know how that's possible, but I guess you can. But, alright. Actually, I'm also going to show you the entrances. Wait, it's nighttime? What? Why is it nighttime? I didn't 100% everything? Uh. Alright. This ain't supposed to happen. Alright. I'm just gonna go to Chow Garden and then... Hang on, I'm actually gonna go to the Egg Carrier. I don't even know what it looks like at um, nighttime. 
the egg carrier, if it, it's like crashed and everything. Oh, it's daytime. Okay. Usually, okay, so if it was at nighttime, it'd be, the egg carrier would be in the sky. So, oh no, okay. Now I gotta keep, there we go. Oh, that was close. I'm showing you another entrance to that child garden while in the egg carrier. First we gotta go down here. And then we go into the this area. Yeah. So you have to go up here and there's a bunch of buttons here. A bunch of letters. You have to it spells Eggman, so you have to put E G G. But I'm gonna show you what you get, what it looks like when you get incorrect. You get see? Oh, whoops. There's supposed to be like a giant one falling on you, but I'm not gonna do that because it always scares me. I don't know why, it just scares me when it because you never expect it. Alright, so you get them all correct, you go inside here. And this actually transports you to the Chell Garden. Alright. So you get sent to the Chell Garden this way. And when you get there, they'll send you to the egg carrier version of the Chell Garden. See? And I'm going to show you... Watch this. Look at, look at that! Look at the size comparison to... Imagine this child being terrified by a giant robot. Wow. Watch what happens when you pick it up. He says pick up. And he does... If you can hear it a little bit. I mean, the music is louder than his than he's, his talking, but... Pick up. Put down. <laughs> That's funny. Because it's like... It's like he's a robot and he would like say anything he does, kind of. Well, not not everything he does, but like, when he picks up a child, he's like, pick up. I, I just thought, I just think it's funny. I want to see if I can get up here with Gamma. Wait, I can. Wait, nope, I guess not. Guess not. Man, really, bro? Well, I mean, that well, before before we before I end this video, I want to just actually show you another. I want to just show you the entrance to the Mystic Cave with Sonic. Select your so, character. Yeah. Let's get him. I mean, it's been 23 minutes, but I'm just gonna show you this real quickly. Like, because there's also an entrance for Mystic. I think it's Mystic. Is it Mystic Ruin or Ruins? It should be. It should be in here. Yeah. Yeah, Mystic Ruins. Okay. So yeah, I'm going to show you the entrance to the Child Garden there. And then we'll end this video. And this is going to be official. This is going to be officially the last video for Sonic Adventure DX. So yeah. Unless I do a no unless I redo a do the in the future, like I could probably do a re I could redo playthroughs or something. But I would still have the original videos. But I would probably like like if I if I if I ever think about it, like no, some someday I may or may not do a a re I may not redo a playthrough of this, or I may so. This may either be the last or not the last playthrough. I mean, last video of Sonic Adventure DX. So yeah, that yeah, that was the entrance to the Mystic Ruins. So I might as well just end the video. So I like to thank you all for watching. Be sure to check out my other videos. This is just a extra video for my Sonic Adventure DX playthrough after eight months of completing it. So um. Yeah. I mean, I just wanted to do it for the 20, 25th anniversary of Sonic. Yeah. Sonic the... Yes. 25th anniversary of Sonic the Hedgehog.
So, anyways, be sure to subscribe, like my videos, and if you enjoyed this episode, be sure, yeah, well, yeah, it's an episode. So, if you enjoy this, be sure to hit that like button, and I will see y'all next time, guys. Thanks for watching.